I can remember watching the coronation. It seemed to go on all day and we went into our, our neighbour's house because they were the only people that had a television and everybody, all the relatives and the family and the neighbours and the friends, we all packed into one room and watched it. It's, and we were there all day. Um, I thought the Queen, I can remember the Queen with a tiny, tiny waist and uh, rather a large, <laughs> rather larger above it. <laughs> um, just a tiny figure uh, in a beautiful dress. I can remember the Queen Mother sitting up on the balcony with Prince Charles and Princess Anne watching. And I can't really remember much more, except that, the, as I say, the ceremony went on all day. When she was going back to the palace after the, the Abbey service, she didn't actually hold her orb and scepter. She had a special unit built into the arm of the carriage that the, set, that the orb rested in and the bottom of the scepter. So she didn't have to strain her wrists. You can still see that on old television films oh. at certain angles when they look into the carriage. The Queen did a drive away, a drive round a couple of days after the coronation and all, our, all the girls at our school had to stand in a line by the side of the road as she drove past with the Duke of Edinburgh. And I remember she was dressed in a, a, a blue coat and hat, but she was gone so quickly. <laughs> We didn't even have time to wave a flag, but I don't actually think we had a flag. <laughs>